do a critique video on you. You know, YouTube sent me this link, so I opened it up to look at a little concrete pouring. It looks so so until the very end, you know, you know, so so meaning, you know, it works, it works, it's it works. I can't be sure when they're timeline or when they're getting on it. So I couldn't cry until uh, the very end. And I'll let you see that just now. Let me get rid of this Bluetooth. So they're going to get the concrete coming. Let's just fast forward this real quick. They're going to pump it. And here we go. So they got their screeds set up. I didn't see them pulling any pins. So apparently, uh, well, you know, it's, it's time lapse. But I didn't see them pulling, pulling any pins. One, maybe two pins. But that's just a straight board. Heck of I know. They're going to tamp it. So leaving your pins in are uh, different. And then uh, is this thing, are these guys uh, walking on the wire and I don't see any flexing of it. So that means they, uh, they're on the ground. Damn thing on the ground. I don't see any chairs. I'm trying to see the chairs on it. Pretty close to the bottom. Right there's a chair. Chair, chair, or oh, every other every other one. So they're going to have a nice little wavy pattern. Uh, I don't know where they're pouring. You know, if the ground's tight, if the surface is tight, then the rebar won't even, uh, and the loads are, it looks like a pad. Let's see, it says uh, steel, concrete slab for steel building. Well, I don't know what the loads are going to be, but there's a footer around the outside edge. We're going to get to the end of this. Somebody in the comments that got upset with the person tamping uh, the concrete. As long as they don't push the stones down too far and leave too much paste up top. You know, I'm a roller tamper guy. Roller tamp is just beautiful. Um, talking about the roller tamp, you've got multiple heads, multiple uh, sizing out to four foot wide. I just spoke, spoke to Marshallton about that for uh, my man over there in Texas, Bar Barney Minium. He's going to be rocking it, I hope. Okay, that's a good channel. You guys should subscribe to it. It's kind of cool what he does and what he shares. All right, so they're going to get rid of this. Let's go ahead and bounce out here. So bleed water. You want your bleed water before you put any steel trowels on it to be gone. You can get on You can get on top of it with a mag before bleed water. That's that's not an issue. Your mag, your magnesiums, you're okay. The steel trowels, though, this is where you're creating a, a coating, sealing it off. So the evaporation is going to be on the, from the top and coming from the bottom. You're going to create a... a a dry plane, if you will, where it won't break its way, make its way through this top surface because you're still still uh, traveling too soon. Um, I'm not saying he's still traveling too soon here. I'm just letting you guys know, but because I can't quite, I don't, you know, it's a time lapse. I don't know if there's bleed water there in this time lapse. Let's go on. I don't. It doesn't appear to be any bleed water. Um, short short down there looks like bleed water, but. It could just be, you know, an optical illusion on the video's part. Let's, uh, I mean, right there, that looks pretty good for non-bleed water. You want to mag it so you can get a nice little, uh, little paste up top when you're finishing it. Now, right about here, so that definitely looks like the bleed water is done. And now he's moving around cream. Got a significant amount of cream there to play with. That's because you probably did a like tamping, pushing down the stone, which leaves you a lot of paste. Weakens your pad, or can weaken? It does weaken your pad if you got stones all down the bottom. You got to, if you're not integral with your uh, mix. Okay, so let's move on. So here they are. Here they got a little pier up here apparently, and yeah, he's brushing it. You know, texturing it. No harm done there. Yes, it's pretty darn wet when he's getting all on it like that. You can brush the water, bleed water off. At some point, though, you're starting to play around with the paste. Don't know what he's doing there. And now, let's move on. He's, that's his head cam. All right, so now he's on to the trowel machine. So now he's got a metal trowel there. This guy doesn't appear to be making any imprints. So it's working. Trowel machine. Steel trowel behind it, the guy with the little magic trowel, whatever they call it, whatever they call it these days in California, wherever this is, different names, little, f I know the Fresno is the other other way, guys. Now, 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 so he's, 
he's trialing it. He's done. Here's the, here's the, here's the rest of the critique. At the very end, he's now going to add water and trial again. I'm like, whoa, what are you doing here? So that's a good way to make it fail. Make your, make you give yourself a nice uh, um, top that will shrink and fail. Look, it looks like he's done. He's actually going to say hose. Let me pull this up for you. Started here. Third truck got us over to there. And then the fourth truck, our pumper had to take off. So we tailgate. Ma max it up a little bit. All right, here we go. Look. So we see, you see that that's nice and dry. No bleed water. He's, he's finishing it. And you'll be, you know, okay, no harm done, no harm right now. At some point, I can't tell, but I, at some point, you're, you've got the full set. And you're not doing anything besides tearing the concrete apart at that point. It won't rebond uh, with, the, with the surface. This is the issue now. He's now, after this step, he's now going to add water and start troweling again. It's not a curing water that he's adding. He's actually delaminating the top, if you will, creating more paste and going at it again. Totally wrong step. Here we go. Um, so I'm like, what's going on here? I watch you talk about a garden hose and spraying it down to think he's going to do that. All, all that happens is that water now has to shrink. When it shrinks, because it takes a mass, it takes mass, it takes a place in, in this pad. It's displacing the cement. When it dries, it now will uh, evaporate and you'll have the voids left where the water removed itself. This water is not from hydration. This water is to help him just force a smooth finish, he thinks. They think. You'll see it in a minute. Like right here, I was like, what's going here? He's spraying water down here because that's, that's not bleed water. That's extra water there. Bleed water doesn't just all of a sudden pop up in the middle like that. The pads are... Clearly, he's all, he's at, it's in the middle of the pad. Here we go. Now, look at this. I'm like, what the heck is going on here? And this is the guy's foot, so he's not sinking in. He's got this thing on full. You know, not full, but he's got it. these pads kicked way out. And he's bringing up cream. Whoa. There we go. Let's do a statement. I'm about the garden hose in here. Watch this. We got Gramps man on the water hose. Paws going nuts on the machine. Getting us a nice clean finish. Getting us a nice clean finish, he thinks. You're pulling up that cream again with that hose. It's no longer curing. It's no longer curing, but you're delaying. You're causing issues. This is going to have all types of cracks in it. Shrinkage cracks. Shrinkage cracks. We'll show up. Wow, I'm just uh, blown away. All right, away. you guys, I hope you enjoyed watching our 35-yard pour. Like I said, these are the kind of things I want to do, bring you on site, show you guys what we're doing, even if it's... Let's go back to it. Paws going nuts on the machine. Getting us a nice, clean finish. Here's the garden here. So cool. Oh, man, it's going to crack all up. It's going to be crack city. All right, I'm going to hang up on this video. Just wanted to give you guys another tip of what not to do there. You can see how, how hard the concrete is, that he's got his blades on tilt like that to try to force this thing to do some extra finishing, if you will. Now, nope, 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 nope.